I don't care if you're broke, homeless, millionaire, top of the world, sleeping in your car, young, old, slow, dumb, fast, non-techie, don't know what's going on, don't know how to fill a contract out. I don't care where you are in your career. I promise you that I have been in the same place that you have been. I want you to know that this is my life. This is real. Relationships are universal. I'm Ricky Carruth and I've been selling real estate for 17 years. It's been the most incredible, crazy roller coaster of a journey that I have ever been on in my entire life. I started out roofing houses when I was a kid. I started selling real estate when I was 20 years old. 20 years old, nobody wanted to hire me. Everybody said, you're too young, right? And so I finally found a broker that would take me, right? And I knew that I was gonna work harder than everyone else out there, but not only that, I was gonna outsmart them. I was gonna figure out what the top producers were doing and I was gonna implement exactly what they were doing, but I was gonna do it better, why? because I was going to do it more than them. I was going to outwork them. I was going to work more hours than they were with the exact same principles, the exact same techniques that they were doing. I was going to do more of it. And my theory was that I was going to eventually be the best, the number one real estate agent in my market. So I worked and I worked and I worked and I worked. And you know what happened? I didn't sell anything for eight long months. I'm a 20 year old kid roofing houses trying to sell real estate with this huge dream to become a millionaire. And I have to wait eight long months of busting my ass to finally make one sale. I had to face so much rejection, so much failure. So many people told me no, right? And I could see it on their face that they thought I was too young, right? That I wasn't experienced enough, that I wasn't good enough to help them buy or sell a piece of property. So you know what I did? I didn't worry about that. I wasn't worried about it, why? Because I saw people succeeding all around me. And I looked at them and I looked at myself in the mirror and I thought, if they can do it, I know that I can do it. It's just a matter of time. It's just a matter of time before I get on a roll, before I start selling properties, before I figure this game out. No, real estate is not easy. Right? It is not easy to get started, but it's so worth it. Real estate is so worth it because you set your own schedule. You help people with the biggest decisions in their life. And it's such a high to help someone accomplish what they're trying to accomplish to help them live a better life. There's nothing better in business than knowing you help somebody. But I didn't learn that until I became a millionaire by the time I was 23, only to lose it all in the crash. I lost everything. I had nothing. I was negative. I had to go bankrupt. I was sleeping on friends' couches. I slept in my car. I went back to roofing houses, worked on an oil rig. And you know what I did? I didn't feel sorry for myself. I didn't feel down. I wasn't unhappy. I was extremely happy. I was happy that I was going through this at such a young age, and I knew that the knowledge that I would get from this experience would carry me to the next level and beyond. During that period, I read over 100 books, and I realized what I just told you. It's relationships over transactions. When you take the transaction out of the equation, and people know that you're there not just for the deal, but to actually help them with the bigger reason of why they're buying or selling, that's when you create a relationship and a client for life. That's when your business starts to explode. That's when you start to reach these incredibly high goals that you set for yourself. Once I realized this, I got back in real estate and I fought and I fought and I fought and clawed my way back to the top. And I eventually became the number one Remax agent in the state of Alabama. But once you get to the top, you think that this is it. This is what you've been waiting for. This is what's gonna change your life. And you get there and you realize nothing changes. You go the next day to work and you realize, I, I need to figure out where, where my next deal's coming from. You start over every day at zero. Most people don't become the number one agent in their state. And the people that do only do it one time. Why? Because they get there and they realize this isn't as great as I thought it was gonna be. And they start to fall off and they, they kind of suppress to the pressure that it takes to stay on top. Very few people make it to the top, but even fewer stay at the top. 
I've been the number one agent three times, I'm going on number four, and I just keep fighting. I'm not through. Now I'm on the biggest mission of my life to help reduce the failure rate in the real estate industry because I don't want to see people go through what I had to go through. I want to share my experiences with every single real estate agent that I can so that they don't have to go through all the failures and all the rejection and, and all the downfall that I did. I've written two books. I'm coaching thousands of real estate agents for absolutely free. I'm the first completely free coach and I'll do anything to help you. What can you do for me? Just take something that I say in a video, something in one of my books, something on one of my podcasts, something on Instagram that I'm sharing and go succeed. Join the movement at zerotodiamond.com. Consider me your coach and reach out anytime. Let's go.